This is the movie theater room. We got a super comfy gaming station. Whoa! It's a box for steam room! Everybody. Oh, someone's at the door! It's such an ominous knock! It must be important. Oh, hello there. Name's Rich Richardson. Richest man in the world. Even richer than Bill Gates. Ah, don't mind if I do. Didn't, I didn't invite you in, but oh, okay. What, what, what do you, what do you, what do you do? As you can see, I am extremely rich based on the size of my cane. It is extremely long, and therefore I am extremely rich. That's how you can tell. Yeah, that, that is a really big cane. Um, okay, I guess you are rich. Anyway, I've been getting into the game a box for real estate. Have you heard of it? For real estate? I mean, we make boxes all the time. We didn't know you could sell them. What do you mean? There's a market for that? Prices are soaring right now. The market is a beautiful time to get in. And I think you might be just the people I'm looking for to sell. A brand new box for it made out of premium cardboard just went on the market this week for 4.5 million tape rolls. 4.5 million tape rolls? That's ridiculous. But also intriguing. Oh, but these are going like crazy. The market is just soaring right now and Rich Richardson is the number one supplier in box board houses. I've sold over 50,000 houses in this month alone. Isn't there like a lot of legal documents or something I have to sign? Don't I have to sit down with like a, like a person and then sign something and then it takes like many days? Nope, it's actually quite simple. To buy a house, all you need is a pen and paper. Sign here and you will be the proud owner of a 4.5 million tape roll box for it. With a compound interest of 13%, that'll come to $18.7 million for the next 20 years paid to me. And uh, sign here. Okay, sign here. All right, deal's done. You are the proud new owner of a 4.5 million tape roll box for it. Of course, with an upfront fee of 1.2 million tape rolls. You, my friend, are now the proud owner of a billionaire box for it. Good we did the deal. All right, sweet, well, where is it? Well, it's in your basement. I actually snuck in last night and built it myself, and if wait, you weren't going to buy wait. it, I was going to stay here until you, you agreed to buy it. So now that you did buy it, I can leave. Thank you very much, and remember the name, Rich Richardson. Richer than Bill Gates, don't forget that. Where, where are you going? No, no, wait, where are you going? I have, I have so many questions. Where are you going? Hey, yo, what's going on, everyone? It's Papa Jake, and we are back with a brand new video, and today, guys, we have purchased... The world's most expensive, the world's biggest, the world's largest, the world's grandest, Logan, I'm running out of words, billionaire box for that has ever, ever been created. In fact, this might be the biggest creation known to man. It might be a Guinness World of Record, Logan. I want my Guinness World of Record to go right there. Beside Papa Jake, Box Fort God, King of Building. Y you didn't exactly build this place, bought we it. bought it. It's the same thing, Logan. If I buy a car, it means I built it. Now, guys, you're probably wondering, Jake, what is inside this massive masterpiece? Well, in fact, it's probably got more in it than your average mansion. We are going to be doing a tour of the entire billionaire fort with all of the... Logan? That's a secret window. No one's supposed to know about that window, Logan. This stays shut. This is a secret exit. Erase it from your memory. All right, we are going to be showing you inside the Billionaire Fort because we have decked this thing out with crazy stuff. Not to mention, we tried to make it as luxurious as possible. What should we do first, Jake? Well, Logan, we should go inside and show off the fort because everyone's wondering what's it look like inside. But before we do that, guys, I do want to let you guys know that there is actually a secret behind this. We are not keeping this fort. Oh, no, no. What? That's, no, yeah, Logan, no, we're giving it away. We are going to be giving it away to one of you guys. Whoever has the top most liked comment in the comment section down below will be pinned at the top of this video. You can scroll down and see if there's a current owner and whoever is the most liked comment will officially be the title owner oh. of this fort. So it could even be you or you or you. It might even be you. I'm talking to you, Matthew or Jeremy. Well, let's get inside the fort and start showing this off. It's MTV Cribs with Papa J. Check it out. We are officially in the very first section of the ultimate billionaire box fort. This is Le Kitchen, as I call it. Jake, what do you want to do first? Well, Logan, we're, we're starting in the kitchen. First, we need to show off the fort, dude. Show them everything that this thing has to offer, and then we can try all of the amazing amenities. I mean, we got gaming, we got a movie. I'm okay, wait, wait, I can't get ahead of myself. All right, so first off, the kitchen. We got food and snacks. We do got food and snacks. We got eating area. We got Gatorade. To be honest, Jake, I don't know why there's a gym in the kitchen. It's kind of weird if you ask me. Eeeh! Uh, 
This is how billionaires drink Gatorade. Out of a cereal bowl? I am eating Gatorade, Logan. It's the billionaire way to do it, okay? And yes, there is a gym in the kitchen because after you eat this Musketeers bar, you gotta burn it off on the gym. Before we move on to the next room, though, I have a challenge for you. There is something secret in this room. Try and guess what it is or what it could be, and we will come back in here in just a minute. But first, we gotta move into the next room. Is the gaming room. Jake, I think this is actually the sports room. Okay, fine, we can call it the sports room whenever you want, but while you're in your billionaire mansion, you might get a little bit bored because it's so big. Because you're just walking around in circles. So you come on into this room. There are millions of games here. There is actually a lot of different games here. We've got horseshoes. We have those Balls. What are those balls, Logan? I have no idea what that is. We've got these magical balls. Oh! For that target! And if you throw the ball at the target like Papa Jake, you get 200. Oh! Can I still dab? Nope. I don't know if dabbing's still a thing. Jake, whatever, of course you can still whatever dab. Whatever it is now, I, you got 60. Over here, we've got baseball. Well, because we couldn't fit a full baseball field in here. We got this mini baseball, which I don't really know how it works. We will play miniature baseball. Now, once you're done in the recreational room, you might want to head in and chill out a little bit. And that's where the movie theater room comes in. Check this out. In every billionaire box for it, you need a home movie theater. This is the movie theater room. We've got our projector set up with our movie screen here. We even got a secondary snack section with all of our snacks, which I gotta say, Logan, you've gone uh, a little unhealthy with the snacks here. Could we not have gotten some carrots or celery? Okay, well, we got more snacks over here. We got the movie theater projector over there. You can choose any movie you want. You can even play YouTube videos. But guys, we're not even half done showing off this fort. I mean, we haven't even started the 24 hour challenge in it. It might take us 24 hours to just show this whole place off. So we gotta keep moving, Logan. We gotta keep going that way. Guys, what movie should we watch? Leave it down below in the comments. All right, Jake, let's check out the next room. Back into the gaming room. We actually have way too many games in here. I don't know what we're gonna do. Oh, we need like scooters to drive around. It's too big to get around on our feet. Horseshoe. Horseshoe. You don't have what it takes to be a horseshoe. You gotta use the horse, Logan. Use the horse within you. Nah. All right, and we're moving on. We're coming back inside the kitchen. No one knows what the secret thing is in here yet. You guys, I bet no one guessed it. No one guessed it. We're not going to show you yet. Either this or this is the secret. So I'm not showing it yet because we got a full other fort to show off. All right. Open up the door here and we head in to the living quarters. Welcome to the first sleeping area. So this is the first room on the first story because this is a two story box fort. Now we got a beautiful bed here with the sleeping bag and pillows. You know, lots of room, very spacious. We also have a mortar. Um, a mortar? A mortar, Logan, to defend this against raccoons. Because you never know when the raccoons are coming, Logan. You ever look outside at night and see them screaming across the street? They're scheming, Will. They're thinking, how am I gonna get in that house and attack you? If raccoons were to invade the house, or zombies, or really anything else, Logan would have to jump out of bed and quickly grab his mortar cannon. I, I, I would be doing this? You would be doing this, Logan, while I'm fast asleep, because I'm don't wake me up ever. I'm grumpy when I wake up. You load the mortars like so, and you arm them. Once the mortars are armed, they are highly dangerous, Logan. Now what you want to do is take the mortar like this, slowly put it like that. Drop it down! You can't just drop it! Fire and fire! Three, two, one! So guys, of course, every billionaire fort is not complete without a working elevator, which is why I have installed this elevator. Wait for me, Jake. It does. It can't take both of us, Logan. It's not that strong of an elevator. Yeah, it can. That's like giving your grandma a fully filled fridge and telling her to carry it 50 feet. She no. just can't do that. My grandma can do it. Oh, oh. All right, elevator, let's go up. Okay, Jake was actually right. The elevator didn't work with me on it. You guys saw already to get to this room, we had to go through one, two, three, four, four rooms and an elevator. All right, we're raising up guys, here we go. It's not the, fa the fastest elevator in the world, but that's okay. And once we get up to my room here, you can see there's a nice little handle here. And we just open it up like so. Now guys, we are actually on the second story here. In fact, I'm not exactly sure how the math works out, but this might be the third story. It's kind of complicated, so it's kind of freaky, but we are on the second story, and this is my secret bedroom. You come in here, we've got a little light on the side of the wall here we can turn on. We can pull up the hatch so no one can get in. 
keep it very safe and secure. Now, it's not the most spacious area, I know, but it is on the second story, which I think is really cool, and it's really cozy. I can confirm, because we can see into the, uh, the underworkings here, that this is, in fact, the third story. One, two, three. So, uh, we are kind of high up right now. In fact, this box fort is so cool because of all the walls and stuff. I don't even feel like I'm on the third story, but if you look out here, you can actually see the entire basement. And in our defense room, of course, we've got our Nerf blaster to take out any raccoons. We also have a Logan's bow and arrow. Logan, why is your bow and arrow in here? Oh, Logan's coming up. Excuse me? Your bow and arrow, you, you brought a bow and arrow in here, man. I devised a little challenge for us, Jake. Three shots at the balloons over there, and whoever hits the most balloons gets this upper floor bed. Okay, all right, I like that. I mean, you are kind of the bow and arrow guy, but I think I could do this. It's a little far away, but I mean, realistically, the balloons are about the size of a raccoon, so. In three, two, one, fire! Okay, that was a little too weak, all right, that's fine, but I got two more here. Oh, come on! That's so close! Yeah, nice try, Jake. Wait, but if you don't hit any, it's whoever got the closest. Last shot, here we go. I'm gonna wind this one up real good. Going for that middle green one. I want that room. Oh, I hit it, though! It's moving, it's jiggling around! I'm so sorry, Jake. That's just not gonna count. Technically, if you don't get an arrow that touches a balloon, I get the top room. Ready? All right, Logan, let's see what you got. Three, Three shots. Two, one. Ooh, that was close, but you didn't touch a balloon. Oh, it's so close. If you think Logan can hit a balloon right now, I need you to like the video, and I need you to comment hashtag balloon. And with enough likes and enough comments, okay. this next shot will hit up. I did it. You did it, dude. Woo! All the likes and the hashtags worked. You guys were able to do it. We hit a balloon. I mean, there were six Jake, set up. We only hit one. I need to get off here. It's wobbling Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll do it. I need to Believe get it out. or not, guys, we actually still haven't shown off this entire fort. So we, we got more to show off. So why don't we go down through the elevator and we'll show you guys the rest of the fort. But so far, the defense systems are looking good. We got an arrow. We got a Nerf gun. And we got mortars. All right, guys, going down the elevator back into the main room. Logan is still all the way up there. See ya, Logan. Now we head back into the kitchen, guys, because there is still three more secret rooms we have not shown off yet. So why don't we uh, head in here? I'll wait for Logan to get down the elevator. One of them is gonna surprise you. Okay, guys, now that we've shown off the living quarters, we are gonna show off another part of this kitchen. It's still not the super secret surprise, but it is part of our billionaire fort because all billionaire houses need to have one thing, Logan. Do you know what that is? A movie theater? Well, no, we already have a movie theater, Logan. You need a steam room. And that's why we have a fully working world's Wait, first- this is the secret? No, no, that's not the secret. There's still a secret. But this is a fully working world's first box fort steam room. Now, I got the steam going. It's starting to get, it's starting to get warm in there. We're getting the steam flowing in here. I have no idea what's gonna happen. Arguably, it's just gonna melt because you're probably not supposed to put steam in cardboard. But while the steam room heats up, I was thinking we could go back to the sports room and, and have a little contest. Then once we're all done and tired in there, we can come back here for a nice steam in the world's first box for steam room. All right, guys, welcome back into the activity room. The first game we are gonna play is the ball toss. We've got these Velcro balls here, and we have to try and see who can get closest to the bullseye. Well, you can't shoot from there, Logan. You can shoot from here, all right? Each of us are going to get three attempts to get as close to the bullseye as possible. Whoever does the best wins this challenge. Loser has to wear this for the rest of the night. How about loser has to go in the steam room? Because I, I don't trust the steam room at all. You're on, Jake. All right, guys. Loser of all three challenges here will have to go in the steam room. Isn't the steam room supposed to be a luxury? It is. Until it's proven that it works. Until then, it might just be a horrible, horrible place you don't want to go. First ball, bullseye, let's go! Second ball, bullseye, let's go! Okay. 150 and 10 points. Okay. Three, two, one, bullseye! Oh, that's actually pretty okay. good. That's 300, 310 points, Jake. All right, Logan, you're up. Let's see if you can beat 310. I'm a professional ball thrower. Okay, oh, oh. So far, that's 270 points, Jake. Well, you, you only need like, just anything to beat me. This isn't good, guys. Hopefully he messes up completely and misses the entire board! 70 plus 80, what is that, Logan? Five, four, three, two, one. Uh, Logan can't do that. <laughs> 70 plus 80 is 350. All right, congrats, Logan. 
Now guys, the next game here we have is Ring Toss. Now it's pretty simple, you gotta throw these and get it around here. Whoever gets the most around here wins the challenge. Channel the inner horse again. Come on, buttercup. Oh, come on. The king back, does that mean I can throw it again? Okay, last one, here we go. Still didn't All even right, get a Logan, point. I got yet. one, so it means if you get two, you win. Miss number one. Miss number two. Miss number three. Oh! No! Go! This game is rigged. Alright, well, we're moving on to the next game in the gaming room. Alright, guys, baseball it is. So it's pretty simple, basically. You've got your little bat here. Logan's got his pitching thing here, and he shoots the ball. So, we all know how to play baseball. Okay, fine. Well, let's, uh, let's see how many home runs we can get. Right one. Strike two. Strike three. Uh, honestly, I, I, I don't really know how this works. We, we got it from the dollar store. I, I do know how to play baseball, but I don't really understand what the flicking and the, this thing. Okay, Jake, it's, it's okay. You don't need to say anything. It's not a... Eh. Home run. All right, well, the next game is a classic. Oh. One that me and Logan have been going at for some time. Oh, Jake wants to play Beyblade. That's right, Logan. Best out of three. Beyblade battle right here, right now. It's made one really quickly. I got a little orange up top, a good heavy middle base. Three, two, one, let it rip. Oh, the battle's on. Oh. Come on. Oh, let's go. Let's go, go. Come on, blue. Ah. Got this. Over oh, the attack, the final kill, the strike, the bait. No, no, blue, blue. Oh, it's a weird. Papa Jake, but it is best two out of three, so Logan has a chance of redemption. Three, two, one, let it rip! Oh, the battle's on! Blue's coming in hot, Logan's going for the spin around! Oh, we're going! Oh, my guess is chilling in the middle, though. He's keeping his stance. Oh, no, oh, no. No, Blue, stay strong! Oh, stay come strong! On, come on! Stay strong! Let's punch go, go. him! Punch him in the corner! No! Yeah! Three, two, one, let it rip! Oh, the battle is on. Oh, Blue's going go. fast. Blue's going in the middle again. Bolt's running around like a chicken. You gotta, you gotta keep the momentum going, Blue. Go. Oh, come on, come on, no! Yes. Stay strong, Blue. Hit him. Stay strong. Oh. Stay strong. Oh! And Papa Jake takes the win. You failed me. Oh, guys, the steam room is going. Whoa, dude! Oh, that's steamy. It was working. It's a box for steam room. Okay. Oh, that is thick cardboard. We had a light up here. The light seems to have, uh, well, maybe melted. The uh, the thickness of the steam in here is kind of good, but it feels like the walls are absorbing a lot of it, and it's uh, it's kind of hard to breathe because it's nice steam mixing with like cardboard. It it smells like wet cardboard in here. It's actually getting really hot in here. I'm starting to get like steam or sweat on my face. If it wasn't for the smell, that's, that's the only thing that's a little concerning is how it smells. But other than that, it's not too bad. It's pretty luxurious for a billionaire box for it. All right, whoo! That was a good steam. I actually got a little sweat going. All right, well, I mean, as long as the carpet doesn't melt, it's a pretty sweet steam room. So we'll let that keep going throughout the night. I said we got another secret. In fact, we still have two rooms we have not shown off yet in this billionaire fort. And guys, I think it's time. After I'm done eating these chips, I will tell you guys where the secret room is. Secret room, in fact, is behind the snack counter. By pushing the snack counter uh, to the right, it reveals an extra room to the box for it. Check this out. The oh, gaming room. What? Oh, it's my favorite room. Oh, the gaming station. We got a super comfy gaming station. We got an Xbox with Fortnite. We got a PC with a bunch of different video games. It's a little small, but I think it's really cozy. As I'm closing up the secret hatch here, so technically, Logan, if anyone were to find a way into this box for it, they would not know we're in here. Logan, I think it's time that we play a little bit of Minecraft. I say we rebuild this entire box for it in Minecraft. Jake, I'm, I'm playing for it. Logan's, Logan's playing for it. All right, you know, that's fine. That's cool. You can play with your cars. I'm gonna play with my cows. Like, like Bessie over here. All right, guys, now that we are finished up in the gaming room, it is time to head on out because you gotta get off the I'm Xbox coming. Bar. All right, come on, let's go. Movie theater room, the movie's starting. First one there gets the best seat. 
All right, guys, we got our projector set up and the wall. We are in here. We've got our snacks all in snacks. We got some peach rings. Fuzzy peach. Logan's chips. got fuzzy. We also got some chips over there. So I think we're going to uh, lay back, uh, pick a movie to watch, and just kind of hang out for a little bit in our box for movie theater. Looks like Jake's going to sleep. Jake, wake up. Is it morning? Oh. oh, Jake, it is not morning time. It was time! Guys, I think it's time to head to bed. We got our billionaire rooms to sleep in. I'm uh, I'm feeling pretty tired. It's been a long day having fun in the billionaire fort. My bunk here. Uh, it is the top bunk. The only issue would be if I roll over in the middle of the night. Then I'm going to fall down like two stories. So hopefully that doesn't happen. That's the only scary thing about this bunk. But other than that, it's really cozy. I got a wall here. I got a nightlight. I'm gonna get to bed, guys, and I'll update you in the morning when I wake up. Night, guys. Hold on, guys. It's another lit day in a box for. Oh, yeah. Just woke up. I have no idea what time it is. Not too bad. It's pretty comfy, pretty warm. I just kept thinking, you know, at least I'm not outside surviving in the forest, so that's nice. I have my comfy little blanket here. Oh, guys. Oh, my God. I almost died. Logan, wake up. It's wake up time. It's morning. Ooh, it might be really early. It's time for breakfast. Breakfast in the billionaire fort. We have Cheetos. Lots of Cheetos. The healthiest part of your day is starting your day with a fresh batch of Cheetos. You can't start your day with Cheerios. It is time to head outside and show you guys the final room as well as play the final mini game. And of course, don't forget guys, if you are watching this, be sure to smack that like button. And if you haven't already, remember to leave a comment down below because if you have the top comment, you will officially own this billionaire mansion. What time is it, Jake? The clock don't work. It's always 10 o'clock in box four land. I'm not eating You gotta Cheerios. be healthy, Logan. You gotta eat your very healthy meals. It's the most, most the unhealthy thing I've seen all day. Okay guys, we are going to the last room inside this billionaire fort. The final room in our billionaire box fort. Check out this map. Jake, it's so big. <laughs> it's I haven't so been big. outside in so long. <laughs> it is huge, dude. No wonder we didn't feel like we were in a box fort. We were in a mansion all night. And we have the world's first, first ever on Papa Jake as well, box fort. Garage. Yeah, check that out, dude. We There's got car for all me the and cars. You. Logan, coming out of the garage. Oh, it's really tight in here. Oh, Every, right. <laughs> Every billionaire box for it needs its own billionaire garage. Oh. Jake. We got our very own tennis court, just like any billionaire would have, except instead of a tennis ball, we're using this. This is some really hot real estate, guys. Leave a comment down below, and whoever gets the most likes, we will pin it. And you will be the owner of this box fort mansion estate. We have the world's biggest billionaire box for it and the biggest one we have ever created. And one of you guys is gonna be the owner. So currently right now, if you scroll down below, one of you might be the owner. Go check if there's an Logan, what are you doing? Logan! We can't be doing that, we don't own it anymore. Logan, Logan, don't shoot that. Alright, well guys, uh, of course if you did enjoy this video, be sure to smack that like button down below as well as that subscribe button. And if you haven't already, hit that bell button so you never miss a brand new video. But of course this has been Papa Jake and Logan. And we'll see you guys next time for another awesome video.